World Vision, formerly the St. Joseph's Centre for Blind Children, is based in Drumcondra and is the only facility of its kind in Ireland. During the summer, they opened their equine therapy centre. We were donated two horses. Uh, we had been doing some work with dogs and with other animals, uh, and so we were delighted to be donated a couple of horses who happened to be bomb-proof. And our therapist took a really keen interest in working with our children and these horses. It has been a fantastic demand, and so we've expanded it. And what sort of results have you seen since you've started using horses as therapy? If you were blind uh, and you start and you're introduced to big animals, you know, there's a big fear factor. But um, I think confidence really in the children who are, who are using it. They're far more confident in what they do and uh, they love the relationship uh, with the pony or with the horse. Horses, by virtue of the animals that they are, they cause a multidimensional movement within their pelvis. So this movement actually helps the children to uh, facilitate further muscle coordination, it increases their muscle tone, it helps them to sit upright, for example. So we use that movement through um, the therapy sessions that we do on the horse to help the child to develop for the children who are developmentally delayed or having trouble um, uh, developing the skills by themselves. The added benefits are we've had huge uh, improvements in the communication of the children because they're just happier in themselves, they're able to move, they're able to uh, interact with the horse and with the people who are working with them. There was one little boy in particular who had a communication delay and some of the first words that he actually mentioned were go belly bow to get the horse to move for him. Sergeant Brendan Duffy of the Garda Mounted Unit was happy to lend his expertise when approached by Child Vision and sourced all the horses and ponies from around the country, specifically for this type of equine therapy. Basically we're looking for similar uh, attributes that we look for in our own horses, and primarily temperament, confirmation, you know, and a kind of an age profile that will suit uh, a facility like Child Vision. What I've noticed from my experience with horses is that they particularly uh, sort of calm down when people or children are about the place and they seem to have a particular instinct in that regard um, and that's hugely beneficial for this whole interaction between the children and, and the animals involved here. An added dimension to the equine therapy available at Child Vision is their equine sensory trails. A sensory trail is a place which is a sensory rich environment which is it takes therapy out into the outside and basically where you want to try to do is to provide a sensory rich place where, where touch, movement, sight, sound are all challenged in the therapy environment. So the child is on the horse, they're dealing with the movement of the horse, they're feeling the horse go over different uh, textures, they've got the wind as you can see today, the light and the sounds and they've got a natural environment in which to challenge them. Visual impairment itself is a sensory, uh, a sensory deficit, so we use other senses. We help to uh, improve the use and coordinate the use of other senses to help them to cope with that and to move on developmentally. We could take therapy out of a ter therapy room and have a children doing something that we wanted them to do inside. We can do it outdoors in a much more natural way and the children are very motivated particularly by the horses and that it accelerates the benefit of our therapy. Go, Toby. Go, Toby.